My name is Wayne McIntyre. I'm a software developer on the Active Directory team. In this video, I'm going to demo the change in Active Directory to now be Numa aware. And so you could take advantage of having more than 64 CPUs and multiple Numa groups on your domain controllers. If you have not yet watched our What's New in Active Directory technical takeoff video, I recommend you watch that first and get some additional context there. So I currently have uh, two insider preview domain controllers. Uh, one is set up running in legacy mode without being NUMA aware. And the other one has the AD NUMA support feature enabled. So one way you can look at the current NUMA configuration of the domain controller is via a new root DSC attribute. So I'll do that now. And it's MSDS NUMA config. And you can see here that it is currently in Disabled state, disabled NUMA is true, true, and the processor count is two. Now, this machine I've set up to have two processors per group, and there's actually six CPUs total. So if I go to Task Manager and take a look at CPUs, there's six. So, But AD is only going to be aware of two in legacy mode. And this has been a common problem where um, somebody deploys an 80 CPU machine, and they only see 40 CPUs, for example. Now, if I switch over to my DC that has it enabled, I'll go ahead and do the same thing and just launch LDP. Let me just make this a little bit bigger. And let's look at the same in my attribute. And we can see in this case, it has a processor count of six, and you can see that there's two CPUs in each group. So we have group zero, group one, and group two. So now I'm gonna start uh, throwing some load over to each DC, and I'll have DC one target DC two first, and switch back over to DC two. And if I launch Perfmon, you could see our ADQ threads total doesn't exceed eight. And that's because by default we have four CPUs or four ADQ threads per CPU. And since AD doesn't recognize the CPUs that are in group um, one and two, uh, those don't get added into the thread pool. Likewise, I'm now gonna do the same thing, but targeting DC one and switch back over there and I could end this and we can look at the same output and here you'll see ATQ threads total is 24 because it's aware of all CPUs. Um, also, if we launch task manager again, we should see that um, the workload is being, uh, being balanced across all six CPUs. And that concludes the demo for AD NUMA support. Thank you very much.